Canva is an entirely online graphic design platform that makes creating and collaborating on social media graphics, animated videos and presentations, and just literally anything else that you can design so easy. But one of the best things about Canva is that you can actually create designs and then share them as templates for others to use. Whether you're using this with your team or you're leveraging it to make a little passive income with graphic templates, here is the simple step-by-step -step of how you can share those Canva templates. Okay, so I'm in Canva and I have a template that I wanna share. These are just some social media templates that I've created. And these ones are specifically for Pinterest and I'm selling these in my shop. So what I wanna do is I wanna share these templates as a Canva template so that when someone purchases these templates from my shop, they're going to get a link and the link will open the templates up as a new file in their account and it won't affect my master file here. So how we do that is we click share, then we click template link in Canva. So sometimes they change up the exact wording here, but anything that says like share as template or template link is what you want to look for. And then it will explain what that means. So anyone with this link can use this design as a template. Their sign in is required, but you won't know who's made copies of the design. So basically anyone who has this link will have their own copy of this document. So go ahead and copy the link. And that's going to be just a plain link. It'll look something like this. And this is what you can share with your customers. Now, let me just quickly show you what that shows up like on their end. So I'm going to open up an incognito window in Chrome. I'm going to paste in that link. So I'm not logged into my Canva account anymore. This is what your customer will see or anyone who you shared that link with. So it'll say a template created by Erica was shared with you. And then it will say use template. So they'll click use template and they'll be prompted to log in or create their own Canva account. Once they do that, it will make a copy of the design and put it into their account as their own design. So they could open this link as many times as they want and make as many copies as they want as well. So that's quite handy if you do have people who make a copy of the design and maybe they accidentally delete it or they accidentally make changes to it that they can't take back or they delete specific pages in the document and they just want to reset. They can just go back and open this link again, click use template, and that's just going to make another fresh copy from your master copy. So this is not gonna affect the copy on your end at all, which is so great for you. Now, the last thing I wanna show you is if you are planning to sell these in your shop, or if you're planning to sell them as a bundle, if you have more than one document with templates and you wanna sell them all together, how's the best way to send those links? So you could keep it really, really simple and just set up a document with a selection of links, Maybe I have three different templates. Let's just pretend those links are all different. But I could say these are the Verano, Pinterest templates, and then these ones might be Instagram templates. This one might be a workbook template. Doesn't matter what the templates are. I'm just showing you a way that you can combine all of these links into a sellable document. So then you could save this document as your template bundle. And then you could upload this to your shop as the digital product that your customer will download. So then they'll get sent this and they'll have access to all of these links. So this is a really simple way you could do it. Obviously, if you only have one, you would just do one. But if you're selling a bundle, you can add them all like this. If you want to make it look a little bit nicer, you can create something a little bit more fancy like we have for our bundles. So we've just created this nicely designed document that has links and a little bit of extra information as well. So we download these documents as PDFs and we upload them to the shop as our digital product. And inside the PDF, it has a link to a tutorial on how to use Canva, which is obviously an optional extra. And then it has links to all of the Canva templates. So these are the Canva template links for each Canva document they've purchased. Then we have just some other information about how to contact us and other tutorials. So we have a PDF for each different bundle. We have a social media template bundle, which has eight different Canva documents. And then we have an Instagram bundle, which just has six, a Facebook bundle, which just has four. But either way, depending on what you're bundling up, or even if you just have one link that you're selling, it might be nice to put it into a PDF just so it looks a little bit nicer but essentially it is doing the exact same thing as that document method we just talked about. It just looks a little bit nicer. 
So that is how you share Canva template links. You can also do the exact same thing on the Canva app as well, just clicking the share button, clicking template link and sharing that link. So whether you're just trying to share a file with a friend or if you're actually selling these templates, hopefully this video helped and showed you how to do it. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments. If you like this video, please subscribe. It helps us to keep making all of these tutorials for you. Otherwise, I will see you in the next video.